Hey, Prodigy Land, it's me, Coach Randy. I'm here to give you a heads up about some things that are going to be happening here on the channel that may raise some eyebrows. You know those public service announcements that we run on Prodigy? Public service announcements, or PSAs, are commercials, but rather than being for a commercial enterprise, like a store or a restaurant or a brand, a PSA benefits a cause or a charity or a nonprofit entity. Ever since Prodigy moved to Kansas City, I started including PSAs on the show that were supplied by a group called the Ad Council. Their PSAs run all over broadcast television. You see them all the time. And I thought they added an element of legitimacy to the show, while maybe even doing some good in the world. You've seen these PSAs, like the ones that encourage parents to adopt teens or encourage fathers to step up and be great fathers. Well, it turns out these PSAs from the Ad Council all have an expiration date. That makes sense for broadcast television, where they can take a spot out of rotation and replace it with another spot, no muss, no fuss. But on YouTube, it doesn't work that way. You can't just pluck out a spot and replace it. You have to take the entire video down from the platform, re-edit it, take out the spot, replace it, re-encode the video, re-upload the video, give it a new URL, retype all the stuff you see in the show notes. It is a monumental pain in the butt, and I am not happy about it. But after speaking with the legal department at the Ad Council, it's clear to me that the only path forward is to replace all those videos, all the Prodigy episodes that we've done since moving to Kansas City. What this means is, in the coming days and weeks, basically during the month of August, I'll be pulling down all the episodes of Prodigy that cover the Kansas City Open and replacing those episodes with re-edits of the shows. The content won't change, but the PSAs will be gone. The good news for you is, it'll have the net effect of presenting fewer commercials and none of the PSAs. But the bad news for the Ad Council is, their spots will never run again on Prodigy Bowlers Tour, nor will any other PSAs for any other group, no matter how worthy their cause might be. Because, frankly, I don't have the time or the inclination to go back in every few months and re-edit our old shows just to replace expired PSAs. So tough luck, Ad Council. But for you, our valued Prodigy heads, just be advised that your favorite Kansas City episode of Prodigy Bowlers Tour will soon be coming down, and then it will be re-uploaded with a new URL. You're going to see a bunch of supposedly new videos going up, when in fact they aren't new at all. They're all our Kansas City episodes of Prodigy, re-edited to remove the PSAs. Starting with episode 128, that was the first one we did here in Kansas City, and going all the way through episode 172, the recent Prodigy TOC, every one of those 45 episodes will be coming down, but then we'll be going right back up. You might notice that all the views are gone, too. Yeah, that part really sucks, and it's the reason why I will never do this again. But now you know. When you notice your favorite episode of Prodigy is gone, just know that it's temporary. I expect to complete this task in time for Season 9 of Prodigy Bowlers Tour when we bring you the 2024 KCO September Point Tournament at the inaugural event of the KCO's 30th season. Anyway, thanks for listening, and I'll talk to you soon when the new season begins on Prodigy Bowlers Tour.